Hey guys, in this video we got a Proxmox server and we have a particular node that has gone completely offline. Now we've already migrated our VMs and everything off this particular server and now we're at the point where we just need to remove it. So as you can see, here's our kind of data center setup. We have five servers and you can see we have that NS507727 is offline and we wanna remove it, right? So once you log into your Proxmox environment, you can see our server. You wanna take note of that server name. So that NS507727, take note of that later to run a command in SSH. So go ahead and open up your favorite utility to connect to the server via SSH, whether that be putty, it might be something else. Go ahead and open that, connect to it via root and your password to log in. So as you can see, I'm connected to a, another server. Now make sure this server is one that is obviously not that server because it's most likely offline. That's why you're getting that error. Let's go ahead and run some commands here. Let's do a PVE CM node and that's going to show all the online nodes. Now I have one offline, right? So that's the one that's not showing up here. So that gives you a good indicator what to remove. So like I said, take note of that dedicated server name. And then we're going to run a command here. That's PVE space DEL node. And then we're going to put in that server name, which is going to be that NS507727 and hit enter. So you can see we ran our command here, which is the PVECM space DEL node space NS507727. Like I said, I want you to keep track of that name for your server as you want to replace it there. When you hit enter, you're going to get that message saying killing node three, which is right up here because I already accidentally ran it before I did the video and it's failing with this exit code one. You can safely ignore that that is just it can't sync to the other uh, dedicated server that we just removed safely ignore that error message let's get back into our proxmox environment and you can see that server is still there but let's go ahead and refresh our page and that node should now disappear and there you have it now it's gone you can get out of your route and you're good to go so now you successfully remove that node that was either offline crash whatever it happened or you just want to get it out of there um like i said you want to make sure if you have a server online and you want to remove it, make sure you power it down and delete it and then run the delete command in Proxmox before you do it live. You want to make sure that server is off, not on online mode. So just make sure you, you remember that. And I hope this video was helpful for you guys. Stay tuned and subscribe for more Proxmox tips. And I'll see you guys in the next one.